So you've just put together your gaming PC and you crank it up getting ready to enjoy your favorite game and out of nowhere your PC just starts to crash, lag and seems like everything is just falling apart. But I'm going to tell you guys that there's a lot more to it. Now a lot of these newer systems are being supplied with very powerful power supplies. The two systems behind me are using a 850 watt power supply and a 650 watt power supply respectively and they never make it past the 60 to 75 percent threshold of using that power that's available. What happens is your CPU is either receiving too much or too little power and this can cause your CPU to either get really really hot and then your system thinks that it is a heat failure and it automatically shuts off or your PC isn't getting enough power which results in a hiccup, a freeze, a stutter, a lag while you are rendering or playing that very very special game and ends up in a crash. So we're going to head over to the PC and I'm going to show you guys how to fix this really quickly. It just takes a few clicks and you should have your system running up and at them any minute. So in a nutshell, what you guys want to do is head over to your PC. You want to click the search bar and you want to type in power plant and you will see edit power plant comes up and you just click that change advanced power settings and what you want to do is find your processor power management and you want to open minimum processor state maximum processor state and you want to make sure they're between 90 percent to 95 percent make sure those are set and system cooling policy you want to have it set to active and this lets your PC increase the fan speed before slowing the processor so you can save some FPS while gaming it really comes in handy and that is all you need to do and click apply and save OK and hopefully your PC will stop crashing while you game. Alright guys that is all you need to do to fix any problems that you might have with your PC especially if you've just put it together and it is causing a lot of stuttering or lagging freezing randomly shutting off while you're rendering or playing video games and hopefully this video has solved your problem if you're new to my channel make sure you drop a like and subscribe and I will see you guys the next time I upload thank you guys so much for watching and before I go make sure you download a few software um, alternatives that can help you determine if your PC is using too much or too little power or if your PC is getting too hot. Now a few of these apps I will leave a link in the description below and that is Core Temp, HW Monitor and HW Wizard and hopefully those can help you solve any other power or heat problems that you might have with your gaming PC. Thank you guys so much for watching and I am out.